Hello, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon. I'm trying to get on to Ashley. This is her. This is Ashley? Yes, this is. Hi, this is this is Chef Jason and I'm calling from B Mobile Bubble with us. Okay. Okay? Like you don't know what's going on or what? <laughs> I'm shocked. You get shocked? Well guess what? The photo that you upload onto Facebook using hashtag Bubble with us was actually chosen. And you get to be my special sous chef today. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to come on bubble or what? Yes, I am. Well, you come into bubble with skills? I come into bubble with skills. I see some of your pictures, you know, so I know you ain't easy. <laughs> so hopefully I see you very soon. Yes. All right, come down one time. Let's go. Come on, bubble with us. Yes, let's go. Welcome to Bubble With Us, brought to you by the B-Mobile 4G Network. It's your boy, Chef Jason, back again. And guess who I am with? Ashley, our first Bubble With Us Ultimate Fan Sous Chef. Good to have you here, Ashley. Yes, indeed, it is. Oh, I got it. I, I actually saw some of your photos on Facebook and some of those great dishes that you had. I felt a little intimidated. Well, it's a woman's face in the kitchen. Oh, my gosh. She started off rough already, so you come to Bubble. I come to Bubble. You come to Bubble. I like bubble. it, you know. <laughs> so, what are we going to Bubble today? We're going to Bubble a nice shrimp stir fry. You like that? That sounds really good. Do you shrimp? I eat a lot of shrimp. You're eating everything then? Everything. Well, let me start the bubble then, am I? <laughs> so I'm going to start my wok up here. So we're going to be doing a stir fry, so I'm going to be using the wok. Actually, I actually have um, some noodles that are just finishing up here. These are some egg noodles. You want to take a look at that? That looks really good. Right. And what I'd like you to do is actually strain them for me and bring them back. Okay. These are ordinary egg noodles that I actually boiled ahead of time. And this is one of the major components in our shrimp stir fry today. Gonna have some sort of noodles, ladies and gents. Meanwhile, I have my wok getting hot here, and I'm gonna start to stir fry my shrimp in a little while. Ashley, how are you going in the back there? I'm going quite fine. All right, bring back those noodles here for me. And let's start with this. So I have a wok here. Now, it's really good to do stir fries in a wok. If you don't have one, a pot works very well, but a wok really works perfectly. These are our noodles. Tom, looks good? Looks really good. Looks nice, yeah? Oh, that looks like ash. Fresh. Very good. So let's put this to the side. Um, I want you to help me with something. You okay with shrimp, right? I love shrimp. Let's go. I want you to start to season it up. Um, I have a bowl there for you. Let's bring that here. And uh, for the viewers, that beautiful shrimp. Look at that. Yes. Look nice. Nice size. I mean, you want to use a nice size shrimp inside of this preparation, maybe like a 16, 20. That's more like 16 to 20 in a pound. It was a nice size to work with it. So it looks good, right? It looks really good. Let's season them up. Put them in the bowl. Beautiful. I'm using about 10 in this preparation right now. I mean, you could use more depending on how much shrimp you like. Um, let's season this up. Uh, what's that? You got the ash? Garlic. Garlic? Let's put some garlic inside there. I like garlic and shrimp. It works very well. It adds that nice pungent flavor. Pimentos. You like pimentos? Pimentos, very flavorful. I think, you know, we, we love pimentos on the whole here in Trinidad and Tobago. It adds so much significant, you know, a slight spice. It's very aromatic also and very flavorful. You want more? I want more. That's enough? Put Next. all up, put all up. All right, oh. take it easy. <laughs> right. um, essential ingredient. Very, very, very. Do you actually important. use this? I use that a lot. Um, because we're actually using shrimp today, I opt to use the Maggi seasoned up fish. And um, how much do you think we should add? I think. Um, just can, about half. It's just about half? Portion, yes. okay. You want to stir that up for me? This is a, such a comprehensive uh, spice mix. There's nothing else that you really need inside of there. I mean, it works flavor, so flavor-wise, it works everything. perfectly. Um, I like spice. Yes. You like spice? Let's add some pepper flakes. I mean, you could put fresh pepper inside of the pepper flakes. Are nice. It's dry. It's concentrated. Black pepper? Just a dot. Just a dot. All right. Yes. Mix that up. How's that looking? It looks really good. Tom! How's that looking, Tom? Looking nice? Yes. Mix it up. Let's see. Beautiful. Good job. And what we're going to do now is actually start to stir fry our shrimp. Why I want to stir fry the shrimp first is I want to get a nice crust on the outside. It's not going to be fully cooked. It's going to be par cooked. So I'm just going to do it for me. Mainly about what? 30, 35, 40 seconds, you just think? About. Yeah, I think that, and that works very well with stir fry because we're going to reintroduce this back into the dish. You want to add some vegetable oil? This is Great. for you. This is for me. All right. Add something like that. So that's enough? That's enough? That's enough. You want some more? 
Just so for good measure. So, so this is what, about three teaspoons, four teaspoons? This is about three tablespoons. Three tablespoons. And you want to swirl it over the surface area of the pan. See that? That is to keep it from sticking. Correct. Okay. All right. All right, let me come on this side and I would like you to stir fry the shrimp. You want to give it a go? Okay, no problem. All right, good. Okay. So I'm going to turn up the wok there for a little bit also. So we want to get the wok really, really hot because that's the only way that we're going to get that nice sear on the outside and bring out that pink flavor, that okay. pink color. All right, so how do you know when it's ready? Ooh, it's popping already. I it's think popping. you're ready to go. It's popping. <laughs> it's a bubbling and popping here going on in the studio. So let's go. Um, I actually have a spoon here for you. Thank you. You want to try? <laughs> okay, so let me help you out. So you're getting the smoke coming up, which is a good indicator yes. that the wok is it's ready. Hot. You want to go? Yeah. Go ahead. I give me some wrist action. <laughs> let me see how you could go. Country you style. want this comp? You want this competition, you know? So you have to give me some sort of flair here. Yeah. Okay, so you call it come to bubble with us here come on B Mobile. Bubble. Looking nice. You could actually see that it's actually cooling. Yes, it's cooling. And you're getting a nice little pink color on your outside. That's a very, very good indicator. You have any Chinese inside here? <laughs> no? Check me chatting. But <laughs> well, you see the idea, right? Yeah. Check that out, Tom. Looking good, right? And that's what we want to do. I'm more or less say 30 to 35 seconds. We work very, very well inside here. So you do a lot of cooking at all? A lot of cooking. We make casseroles. Casserole pies. I even bake a lot. I saw the dish that you actually did and you posted on Facebook. Yes. It was a, a vegetable casserole, right? Actually, it was a chicken broccoli casserole, something that I invented with a, a special a base made out of plantain where you get really nice ripe plantains uh -huh. and you boil them with just a little touch of ginger so it will absorb that flavor and you start off as a base but then you, you just lay it up. It looked really good and I mean everybody on B-Mobile was saying oh my god this looks delicious and that's why we chose you. Yes well thank you. <laughs> Alright so I want to do is put this in here the side. So here we are with our shrimp. We're going to put this inside, side. And we're going to start with the stir fry immediately. So yes. I'm going to turn down the heat a little bit. You want to add some oil there for me? And this is going to go by very quickly. Let's add, that's perfect. Let's add some garlic, pimentos, some purple onions. You want oil? Yes, add oil. And stir them up for me. Awesome. And make sure that you fry up the onions nicely until they become a little translucent because you can smell it. You can smell it, and that's very, very important. Um, some carrots. And those are julienne carrots. You want to keep them nice and thin because that's what a stir fry is about. I'm going to prepare some mushrooms here in the meantime. These are some nice dried shiitake that I actually rehydrated. You know they have the dried ones inside of the pack that yes. you could actually rehydrate in some hot water. Sometimes it's a challenge to actually find it. And what I like about these is that they're very, they have a lot of texture to them. They're meaty. But so how it, long do you um, put it in the hot water for? Well, once you boil some nice hot water, what I actually did is that I uh, boil maybe like about two cups of water and I placed a Maggi bouillon cube inside of it just to flavor it up. Okay. And I placed the mushrooms inside of it for more or less 15 minutes just to rehydrate. And I think it worked very, very well. So I'm going to add them to it now. There you go. Looking good, right? That's good. So you see how quick this is going already? It's a very, very fast dish. Some pak choy. Ordinary pak choy. I mean, I, pak choy is something that we don't really eat that much these days, but it's good to introduce it and bring it into the, you know, our local ingredients here. All right. Broccoli? Broccoli. I looking good that. already? Looking really good. Tell Tom. Tell Tom. Tom, Tom. looking at that. Have Tom. A look. Looking nice? Some bell peppers. You like bell peppers, I right? I love bell peppers. I love the colors. I think this is what it's about food. It's got to look attractive, right? Yes, it brings so much uh, different things to it. You know, different color variants. Yes. It looks attractive. Very, very attractive. And that's important. Snow peas. Have you ever had these before? I have never tried Try this. Try one. Tell me what you think. Mm. Not bad, right? It's good. It's, it's nice cool. and crunchy. Very, very, very nice. So, are we looking there? Fine. You can, are you walking like a Chinese girl, boy? <laughs> Look at she, she handling that work, Tom. Look she handling that. Good job. Let me so ask. I'm from this walk today, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> you, you, you're taking the work part of walking up. <laughs> oh, everybody just wants to, like, you know, like, advantage me when I come on the show. They want to take away the pot. Last week, a few weeks ago, somebody told me they want to take away the pot from me. Go. Boy, I don't know what it is. Let's put some black pepper inside there. And uh, what I'm going to add to it is a little bit of poison sauce. Poison is actually what? 
I'm not sure. It's actually Asian barbecue sauce. So mix them up for me there. Go ahead. Yes. I'm gonna add a little bit of orange juice. The hoisin tends to be a little bit of sweeter flavor. So I'm gonna be adding a little bit of citrus to it to give it a punch. It's nice. Fresh orange juice. Fresh orange juice. You looking nice? Very. I think it looks really attractive. Very, very, very nice. And um, of course. What about these bad boys? Yes. <laughs> it's about that time. Trim. It's about that time. Oh my god. I said it before I said it again. That is food porn. <laughs> Look how nice this is actually. This looks really, really good. I mean, um, I definitely, I, I'm, I'm glad that you came here because you bubbled home, you posted and you reached here. Yes. And I mean, people see this and they can see someone such as yourself doing this. They can so, see how easy, why not? So if Ashley simple. could do this herself. And in a matter of two or three minutes, here we are. Looks good? It looks really good. Awesome. So we want to season this up. What I have here, Maggie, onion and garlic, bouillon cube, mix it up for me. And that's going to add a lot of comprehensive flavor to it, a lot of depth. And the onion is all those nice little flavors that comes together with the garlic. It's all ingredients that are in it already. Looking good? Looking really, really, I think really, really you're pretty good. good. I think you're pretty good there, you know. We can take this off now and we can start the plate up. Yes. Where is it? Let's all start the good, plate. All good. Let's start the plate. Let's I want, go. I want a big plate. I, I cook take, all uh, this. Take it easy. I want a I always face in this problem. People want to take okay, all okay. the food. Well, I offer you a small plate. All right, I'll go take her again. I, I really like a cow in. All right, let's do this. So Ashley, we looking good? We're good. We're good to go. to go. Nice and smoky, ready to roll? Ready to roll. So you don't want to plate up? We go bowl it up now. Bowl it up? Bowl it up. My God. All right, you're kind of right, you know, because we're actually not plating it up, we're bowling it up. Just taking enough for you, eh? Just enough for you. But there's we're plenty, we're on... there's plenty food to take in our day. I cook this for me to eat. All right, I'll go take a little bit now. Yeah. So I'll put in my noodles stuff. <laughs> That's enough for me? Yeah, that's enough. That's hey, enough. Darling, that's enough. Don't take no more, you know. Alright. There you go. I'll put some tie there. So I put any noodles at the base. Oh, yes, I'm more than mine. Relax yourself. That's my own girl. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. And I want you to put the veggies on top. Give me a nice heaping veggie on top there. Of the sh oh, look at that. Alright. Beautiful. Oh, Looking please, good. It smells so good. Give me a nice couple. Make sure that shrimp is. Oh, yes. Tom, looking good? Looking yes. good? Give me the next one. Organize the next one in the meantime. Let me garnish it up now. What do you think? Um, we like chives. I love that. So I'm just going to take some chives and cut them on the bias like that. And this is going to add an element of freshness to the dish. We you be? Nice. Oh my God, you're looking good. Yeah, looks good. All right, so we want to make sure we... How you, shrimp? How you have more shrimp no, than no, me? No, exactly. I cooked it. But why only the strict me so here on Bubble Boys, my show? When the woman cook, she has more meat. Eh, eh, right, mushroom for me. Right, okay. <laughs> so here we go. Some nice chives on top. Yes. What do you see? Looking good? That's good. Yes. And to make it even sexier, a little bit of sesame seeds. Yeah? It's really, really healthy. It's a little, it looking good, Ash. It's looking really good. Right. So, and then we're going to take a little bit of cashew nuts, just for crunch. You like cashews, right? Yes. Cool. How are we looking there, Tom? Give me a thumbs up. Tom, would you like a bowl? No, no, no. I Tom. can offer you his bowl. No! Tom. Don't give Tom any. Tom, look at this. <laughs> look at this, Tom. Looking nice. So you get a nice crunch of the cashew nuts inside there. You have the sesame seeds, the freshness of the chives, all those great vegetables. And it's very important that you don't overcook the vegetables. Yes. And you see the shrimp is all vibrant and nice. So you want to try this? Ash? I would love to. I would really, really all love right. to. All right. So check this out. There you go. What are you doing at? It's chopsticks. I am a country girl. This is for slinging shot. Oh no, this pan sticks. Mm. <laughs> nah. But that's what you're going to do with the chopsticks to get what in here? What do you do with it again? Hear this, right? Oh, I like you, these things. You use fork? Yes. Pa, pa. Spoons will work too, but this is, this is I, the required. I, I, she's telling me like I stush. <laughs> I go into that. Yes. So you want to try this? Yes. All right, so dig in. Go on. Well, Which you take the bowl right, with the okay. more shrimp in I it. tried to pull something. Oh, Tom, he take your bowl. He take your bowl. Let's go, let's go. Yes. You ready? Yes. Let's go. Mm. Mm. You know, this is really, really good. It's not salty. It's so fresh. You get any hoist and sauce, the citrus, the fruitiness of the orange juice inside here. You crunch the nuts. I love it. Trash them? No. 
Tell me what you think. Mm. You looking good? Mm-hmm. Good, she can't talk. Mm. She mouth full. <laughs> hey, don't talk with your mouth full, girl. You're that country girl. Your mother should have teach you better about that. <laughs> <laughs> so you had fun bubbling with me today? I did indeed. Thank you for coming. I really appreciate it. I mean, I feel really privileged to have you here. This is Ashley again. She won the competition and she could actually attest to you. I mean, post your pictures up to Facebook, to Twitter, to, to, to Instagram and use the hashtag Bubble With Us. And you could be actually standing in her position right now. Isn't that right? It's an amazing opportunity to be here. You really, really learn and you really be a part of the whole system of cooking. It, it, it's fabulous. Oh my God, I get a huge blind here. I'm feeling like a brand new shilling. <laughs> <laughs> so ladies and gents, don't forget, check out new episodes right here on www.bepartofit.com slash bubble with us every Thursday at 3 p.m. Yeah, you never know. You might actually be on the next episode once you send those pictures up to bubble with us, hashtag bubble with us. So, see you next time. No, I will my shrimp, please. Um, Come now. Uh, I take it all. Oh, gosh. All right, all right, take it. Oh, gosh. Come, Tom. This is saying good, huh? Mm -hmm. I like it. <laughs> we use a certain type of barbecue sauce in the preparation today. Do you know what it was? I said it earlier on. Post your answer to www.bepartofit.com slash bubble with us. And you can win excellent prices. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's all she could say right now. <laughs> Don't forget, post your answer. Be mobile.